Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, my name is Colleen. In today's video, I am doing a haul. I haven't done a haul in such a long time, so this is a little bit weird to me, but I'm very excited to show you guys some of the things that I picked up in the month of February. To be honest with you, I love doing hauls, but I haven't been buying a lot of things or enough things to the point where I can make consistent hauls like I used to. I feel like I've just been a little bit more responsible, just a little bit, with how I'm spending my money and what I'm buying. So we'll see how long it's gonna take me to get out of that habit, but it's a good habit and I'm really liking it so far and Always 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 a disclaimer I'm not in any way shape or form trying to brag about the things that I have if you're liking this video so far Make sure you guys are subscribing to my channel and also following me on my Instagram as well as my TikTok. I will link both of those in the description box for you guys So I think I'm gonna start off with some beauty products because I honestly didn't pick up that many this year this year this month so the first thing i actually got for my birthday from my friend emma so this is the clarence lip comfort oil can i just talk about this for a while because the color is in red berry and it's very very sheer but in my books i honestly prefer a lip oil over a lip gloss any day just because lip glosses kind of get sticky and tacky and i honestly don't I'm not the biggest fan. I feel like I want to try different colors as well because it's so nourishing and moisturizing. Go get it. Go try it. The next thing that I got was actually for my hair. This is my first bleaching session, so I've been trying my best to really maintain the tone or else I'm afraid that it might get a little bit orangey or brassy. Sorry guys, I keep touching my hair because I don't know, this is like this first day hair so it's not really sticking right now with my hairstyle. So basically they're just leave-in brunette toning drops so it's nothing permanent. It's a little bit temporary I guess. This is the IGK Mixed Feelings Leave-In Brunette Toning Drops. I think they have the purple one as well and like a few other colors but I'll link it in the description. Basically it's just like a little dropper like this and you just press it from the bottom here and it comes out in little drops I put it into my hair oils and any of my after washing products so if you guys are interested definitely recommend trying this I feel like it definitely has helped especially with like the pieces towards my face here I think it was around like $30 but for what it is I feel like it's good enough for the price Moving on to some clothing pieces because I know you guys are all here for that I think I'm gonna start off with this pair of pants here so i got these from uniqlo and let me and tell you guys how amazing these are so these i had originally in my black pair of jeans they're my go-to pair of black jeans because they have not faded on me it's not too baggy and it's also not too fitted for a pair of jeans so when i found these jeans at uniqlo i just took a little look and I knew the original price was around like 50 or $60, but they were on sale for $20, guys. I hope it's still on when this video goes up. Such a pretty pair of jeans, and I love the fit of them. I think you can never go wrong with also like a beige pair of pants. And they're very flattering. And this one, I got a 24. It still has a lot of length to it and enough room to like move around on the waist. So pretty, and I'm so excited to wear them for the springtime. If anyone is wondering, it's just called the regular fit straight high rise jeans. Can't believe they were $20. The next thing that I got was something that I actually wear a little bit too frequent, but I mean, that's a good sign, I guess. For me, I feel like it's very hard to find like a pair of denim jeans that just fit really nice and the wash is good. When I saw these, when I was thrifting, I was very excited and good pair of worn in denim that I don't need a break in because especially with like new Levi's nowadays, they're so stiff and you really have to like work it in and like fold it, throw it, kick it, step on it to really just work the denim in. The yellow tag has been washed out so I can't honestly tell you which style they are but if you guys can read it let me know it looks like it says 501 like down here but i'm not too sure so if you're looking for like a really good nice pair of jeans that are just like a regular light wash check your thrift shops check your consignment shops so moving on to the beloved aritzia i haven't really spent too much money at aritzia in a while but i'm very excited to show you guys some of these things because for me at least i feel like these are staple pieces that i actually wear a lot in my wardrobe so the first thing that i got was a pair of the Greenwich pant or the Greenwick. I don't know how to pronounce it to be honest with you, but I got it in this like olive color and they're basically like a carpenter pair of pants and 
obviously the sign like the little label here kind of looks like carhartt but i got this in a size two so initially i always usually buy like a zero or a double zero but for some reason i really liked how the two fit for this it makes it more of like a mid-rise and a little bit more length for me at least i feel like they got shorter because i tried on a pair a few years back and they were significantly longer than what they are now so if you're kind of having that little issue there too i would suggest sizing up but i really love the color i'm honestly gonna wear these today when i go do my driver's license because it's apparently expired i don't know and it's honestly really nice just for the springtime but i feel like in the winter time right now i'm also leaning and gravitating towards this color because i need more color in my wardrobe compared to black i say this now but i bought like 12 other pieces that are in black so i don't know how accurate that little statement was but continuing on with some pieces of from aritzia so this top i also wore for my birthday this is the santorini cardigan and again i've said that it's kind of like a dupe for the jacquemus cardigan that everyone wears on instagram and things like that for a significantly cheaper price and it's also very very flattering so comfortable and warm but i got this in a double extra small and it fits perfect i love it so much if you guys saw my birthday video then you guys must have seen me wear this but i love how nice it looks on and it just makes things look a little bit more put together if you're wearing like a pair of jeans and this was another option i also put in my video but i just haven't worn it yet i'm debating whether or not i should keep it because although it's so flattering i don't know when i'll wear it it'll probably be in the summertime but summer is so far from now so realistically do i need this i don't know but it's just like a crisscross little halter top like this i got this in a double extra small and it's like a ribbed material very cute very comfortable i don't know i really like it i just don't know if i should keep it or not so let me know what you guys think of this piece if you guys have it the next thing that i picked up was the little bbl jacket i feel like i have talked about this a couple of times on my channel it's called the relay tna life zippa i got it in a double extra small i got it in the black i'm contemplating if i need it in the white because i actually wear this a shit ton so let me know if i should do this splurge again in the white it has like the little tna symbol at the back honestly i love it so much the quality is really really good it has the little thumb thingy here that i just adore and if you guys are looking for like a cheaper alternative to the little bbl jacket that everyone's talking about from lululemon um i would highly recommend trying this one too the next few pieces that i got so this one i was kind of excited about because i got it for my birthday so this is a set from skims so i have i own this in the black i think these are just like the boyfriend shorts i got these in a double extra small they look like literal boxers but when you put them on it looks a little bit more forgiving and it doesn't really look too much like boxers the black one i love so much because it just looks like a ribbed pair Pair of biker shorts and I love how they fit they're very flattering and it's just something to wear to sleep I guess and then maybe in the summertime who knows we'll see and I also got the matching top for it as well so really really loving this gray color right here and this was actually on my birthday list of things that I wanted for my birthday and my friend Elisa got it for me so shout out Elisa I have another skims top from my friend Julie which I'll show you guys the next skims piece that I got for my birthday I was so excited because I've actually talked about this piece with julie a couple of times previously and then she got it for me for my birthday so this is like the cotton i think the cotton little t-shirt and i love it so much i wore it in my birthday vlog when i went with a few of my friends for dinner and it was honestly it's so comfortable it's so flattering as well i've never worn like a t-shirt where i just felt like an ultimate baddie and that's weird because it's just like a plain t-shirt skims if you're watching this i love these little t-shirts you guys have to come out with more of my sizes because i'm about to splurge and buy everything i also got some bikinis and bathing suits from 437 they actually gifted them to me so i'm very excited to show you some of them this is the Aaliyah top but i got it in this brown color and it's basically one where you kind of just like tie here just goes up and it's like a thicker band really really cute and i love the color i feel like it's very rich and you just look like you have your shit together in this brown color it also has like a matching pair of bottoms and this is the matching Aaliyah bottoms they just look like this 
it have like a little bit of a ruching moment here in the front highly recommend 437 i'm sure you guys have heard about it because i think everybody and their mom is wearing 437 so why are you not and then they also sent me this flora one which i'm so excited about but i really like the pattern on this one it's just so pretty and then when you have a nice tan because i'm pale as hell right now i think it'd be really cute so it's just like a triangle top here. I got this in a size small. Okay, guys, the last thing that I wanted to show you guys is something that my boyfriend got me for my birthday. It's just the Telfar mini small bag. I love my Telfars. I have it in the dark brown. I have it in the UGG um, collab with them. And then the green now and i'm so excited because i think the green would look really nice with like an all white outfit or like a cream beige outfit and also wear like an all black outfit i think it's just very versatile much more versatile than i thought it would have been i felt like i was gonna have some trouble with it but when i saw it in person i was like yep yep okay guys i think that is it for today's haul video i'm so sorry the lighting is just a little bit off today and it's honestly not the best but i hope you guys enjoyed watching this haul let me know if you guys would like to see more i'm sure you guys will because you guys have told me you guys have missed my hauls but i love you guys thank you so much for watching today's video make sure you guys are subscribing and comment down below some new pieces that you might have picked up or some of the pieces that you liked in this video i always answer all of my comments so if you you guys want to chat a little bit make sure you guys are leaving a comment down below and i would love to start a conversation with you guys Mwah! i love you guys and i hope to see you guys in my next one